Hi, I'm Ronnie and this is Bulgaria. Today we're heading off to Pavlikeni Market. So uh, I'll show you what it's like, show you around, maybe show you uh, the cost of a few things. Okay, see you there. Nice quiet road uh, to Pav Pavlikeni, but you do have to watch it for the odd horse and cart. Well, this is Pablo Kenny Market. It's on a Tuesday morning every week. And we're going into the vegetable part of the market first. Just to round to the right here behind this truck is a place that sells animal food. Jasty. Video for YouTube. And that's my next door neighbour in Resin. He lives about 100 metres up the road from me and he grows all his own produce and then sells it at the market. Tomatoes, loads of tomatoes. More tomatoes. Cases of tomatoes. Yeah, there's just about everything in this uh, vegetable market, including nuts. This is my favorite stall. I got a big bag of cashew for 10 lev, which is approximately four pounds. And they're all, or most of them are about 10 lebs. And there's bags of olives and jars and olive oil. And we want some fruit now, peaches there. And as you can see, it's a big social gathering for the Bulgarians as well. Everybody stopping, shaking hands, and chatting. And it can be for the Brits too. Uh, many a time down in the market, bumped into friends or new friends. Around right here we've got some flowers at one lead each. And those eggs were at 22 satinki. In the village shop they're between 30 and 50 depending on the time of year. And more tomatoes. Oh and cherries there. I've got a freezer full of them. Of my own trees. More people just talking around. And at the beginning of the year, there's uh, chickens and rabbits, ducks, and things like that for sale as well. Ooh, it's also good. It's a bit quiet down this end today. Could be because I'm early. Duvets, pillows, curtains. And over the other side here, you've got your strimmers, chainsaws. 
All is cheaper than uh, in time. Carpets aren't widely used here, but uh, throw carpets like that uh, come in handy from time to time. Oh, and camouflage gear. I'll have a look at that, I think. Coco Pony Camis. I said Camis, but that's Arabic for t shirt. Seven Lever. Gulamo. Oh, Gulamo, name Monogo. I should have said Malco Gulamo, not Full Gulamo. Okay. Yeah. Hello? Hello? Head not, yeah. Uh, seven level. Seven level. Seven. 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 And she was asking if I wanted trousers, which I don't need. Gabro bet stick. Huh? Huh? Like that. Chop. Well, that t-shirt cost me seven lev. I'm just about to find out that I could have got it for five. And this is a restaurant that I normally have a cup of coffee or a salad at. But today I'm a bit early. Coco Puri Kamistan. Yeah. Pet Lever. Like that. Five Lev instead of seven, I could have paid. Coco Puri Kush. Right, that's it. Come on, Ronnie. 24. Think, man. I see awesome. 24 left. And we've got some gas cookers and all the cleaning equipment, the kitchen, wire brushes. Video, YouTube. Wondering why I'm videoing. Thinks I'm spying on him for the taxman, maybe. And lots of pots and pans down the bottom end. It's always polite to ask if uh, you're going to video people and. This is a camera that I was uh, looking at earlier. It's for the front of the car or the back. You know. He thinks it's 50 lives. He wants 55 lev for the camera, but I'm offering 50. So he's taking out the car. Yeah. 
I've convinced him to put the card back in, and he says 55 left. But I hand him 50 anyway, Merci. and he grabbed it. So I've made up for paying too much for the shorts, uh, the shirt. Well, I hope this has been helpful. See you next time.